We are talking with Laura and Ferson about Laura's career in construction, which is fairly new. She is working for Merrick Brothers now, but she heard about construction, I understand, from community family centers. So how did you get involved with community family centers? Um, well, I used to go there. My mom takes English classes there. So I found out they were doing the NCCER course for the construction. And I went in and took the course, uh, which is really fun. You get to play around with tools and build stuff. So you like the hands-on? Yes. It kind of gives you a chance to just build and destroy and build again. And there, the graduation teachers are great. Um, they open the doors for employees, for another employers to kind of look you up. Um, I met one of the employees at Merrick. I got an interview right there and then and got hired. The same day of graduation? Yes. I got the interview the same day and then a week later I was already working. Very nice. So when you came to Merrick, what did they start you doing? Well, you go through a safety course. Uh, you go through all the safety training. They kind of like to get familiarized with the tools. And after that, you just go straight to the job. Little by little, they start teaching you every step of the way. So you get, you're doing the job, but they're teaching you all the way. So you never felt you were left alone. You no, always had somebody to help show you. Yes. Either the supervisor, my co-workers, uh, Fairson's always there on the phone checking us, you know, like checking what you're doing, what you guys got to do this, and you know, you're always, you always have somebody. You don't know something, you don't know how to do something or you're not familiar, like very familiarizing how to cut or do something else, there's always somebody that's helping. That's good. Fairson, what can you tell me about, about people like Laura, and Laura in particular, about her training and how you bring her up into construction careers? So like, um, you say like, Mary just started doing uh, their hourly employees for drawing, like a year and a half. So I got hired then, and they started telling me, now you're going to be in charge of making a crew from everybody's hourly. And so they started showing Laura, they, they told me she got experience on, on kind of construction side, so okay, so they took Laura, and, and she's really good, and we, what we do, we, uh, we try to teach them from the bottom, like, they don't, they don't know anything about flooring, well, they, we can see it like they're really changing the week, the way, the way we teach them, and they just, we spend time with them, and time, and, you know, they, they do something wrong, they, we don't move away, and let me do it myself. They have to keep doing it until they do it right. So it's Last. okay if they don't know anything in their background about construction, you can teach them? Yeah, we can teach them, yeah. It's just, there's people that have never stepped, um, stepped in construction. They have never wear a hard hat, and we can, that's the way to teach them. We need to spend time with them, and just, if they, I will tell you, they do something wrong, don't move into the side, just keep doing the same thing until they do it right. And that's basically what we do over here. Just explain, like you do it wrong the first time, they're like, look, if you do it this way, it'll be better. Just try to do this, and they'll correct you little by little, and you do it right. You get it. So you get lots of chances to, yeah. and that way you learn. Yes. That's you actually you, get a chance to make mistakes. That's how you make right. people right. They, nobody's perfect. They always want to have mistakes. And by myself, I did a lot, a lot of mistakes when I started doing flooring eight years ago and you know you're gonna mess up here and there but we try to avoid those because we don't want to waste too much material that's no that's right so, that's but at the same time you're you're developing a, a, a better workforce because yeah. you're teaching new workers how to do it right even if you have a background in construction like i i used to work in construction before but it was completely different what kind of construction were you doing? I used to do marble, like old stone, natural stone. Um, it's completely different. It's never the same. Yeah. And no matter where you go, in here, where like if you start from the bottom, and they build every step of the way. So and your department here is in flooring, correct? Yes, we're on flooring. It's just fun. It's always fun. Every day is different, and every day it's fun. It's, it's like, what do you mean fun? What do you like about this? Uh, my coworkers, my bosses, they're. They're, they're always together, like you never, you never feel left out and you never feel alone. So, and you always get chances and you always get opportunities and that's what I like, you know, a job that is, it's fun to go to, 
because you always have people around you always joking around, you know, um, but you're always doing the work. So it, I like it. <laughs> and you seem to have a really good attitude. Do you think that helps you in developing your career and advancement? I think we all have a good attitude around, but there are good days and there's bad days, but that might be. For any job, <laughs> yes. Yeah. What's your favorite thing about working in the flooring? What, what have you liked doing? Um, or not, you know, or just the idea of what you could do in the future. What do you like? What do I like? That you start something and you actually get to finish, the, uh, and you get to see the finish result. So when you see something, you're like, oh, this is impossible, you're never going to finish. And then it comes a day you're like, oh my god, we did that? That's so nice, that's so beautiful. So you get to experience that. That's what I like. Is that what I'm telling like, you, like, me, I, you know, nobody likes to go to hospitals after that, you know, something has to go once in a while. And you show to your kids and your family, look, I did this, and we did this, and you feel proud of it when you see it. That's what, that's the way I feel. That's the way I tell them they're gonna start yeah. feeling it because, oh, well, they're gonna pass with the building and say, oh, look, we did that, the floor in that building. And, yeah, you walk around like, look, I did that. Like, oh. I built that. <laughs> that's so, wonderful. And floor in Merrick, it's a, I don't know, you know, it's a brand new. On flooring, they have flooring the flooring department. is a new department. They have a flooring department, but now they have, they're starting, they want their early employees. So they do a lot of software, but they have early employees. They, that's what we're trying to do. We got seven right now. We're trying to build that up. up so. Perfect. Yeah, well, more more. thank you both so much for your time today. And um, I've really enjoyed learning about the flooring department at Merritt. Thank you. Thank you.